Oh, well, hello there. <laughs> yes, I'm here with the, the Marquis and the Venerable Miss Fraser. <laughs> and I'm smoking a, a rather delightful cigar. <laughs> Uh, which was very, very kindly, uh, one of uh, several that uh, Pierce, uh, Dove and the Dam, sent me. Uh, this one is... Uh, now, we, we've all uh, come to the uh, agreement, we believe it's called a diesel. Yeah, we did, yeah, we agreed that. Now, of course, we're probably wrong, and it's probably pronounced quite differently, but uh, most enjoyable uh, smoke, watching the, uh, the new... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the news, well, it's not that new, it was out last year, my birthday, in fact, because I went to see it. Oh my, the new Sherlock Holmes, but I ordered the DVD which came today. But the thing I like most about this cigar is that it prevents any kind of uh, boundarish behaviour because the band is placed on the end of the cigar, so you have to remove the band. Which uh, is, is very good. So, anyway, I thought I'd just. Uh, Thank uh, Pierce. Thank you very much indeed, mate. Uh, this is the first of them I've smoked, so I thought uh, I'd do a little review. Uh, much appreciated, mate. Thank you. Hello. Um, it's Sunday morning here. Uh, the Marquis and the Vulnerable Miss Fraser are long gone. And um, I thought I'd just do the second part of uh, what was is a little bit of a thank you video last night? Was the Pierce Dub and the Dam who sent me some uh, lovely cigars? That uh, Diesel, I don't know whether that's how you pronounce it. Who knows? Um, <laughs> I am sorry, just turn something off there. Um, it was very nice, very nice cigar indeed, and I very much enjoyed it. And I look forward to smoking the other ones. Um, the part two of the, I've got a bit of a, the second part of this thank you is to the Pipe Freaks, to the Count and Junior. Now, I'm hoping this is going to go well because I've got a bit of a cold. Not surprisingly, because to be perfectly frank with you, the weather here is Baltic, as they say. Um, rain, cold, it's May, you know, whatever happened to summer really. We had a week. Where I was able to sit in my garden, you know, colour the skin a little and uh, all the rest of it, but it's uh, sadly gone. So anyway, enough of that. Um, the Count and Junior were very, very generous and very, very kind and sending me this delightful little silver spoon. Uh, I believe it's... Um, original function was for salt in a, a, a cruet set, is that right, cruet set? Maybe, <laughs> it's Sunday morning. So anyway, uh, they, uh, the Count said what it, that it would be a superb, because he saw the pathetic stuff spoon I bought from um, a snuff, snuffstore.com, no offence to snuffstore, but it was pathetic and um, sent me this and uh, and I'm very very grateful and, and uh, was over the moon and excited and pleased so even though I'm suffering a little from uh, a summer cold I am going to take a couple of uh, toots it's probably a bit too big a toot for my current health predicament a couple of toots of old Paris a favourite snuff of mine for those that don't know, it's um, a kind of coarse moist snuff with uh, a rack, which is a kind of date liqueur as its um, flavour. And it's, uh, you know, uh, quite pleasant. So here we go. The first, the first uh, toot with the new uh, snuff spoon. Perfect. Let's have a little dust. You should always dust after taking snuff. It's uh, avoid any um, any uh, snuff moustaches. <laughs> I saw a chap once, you know. Uh, it was 
smorts the German snuff and he puts a, quite a large amount on the back of his hand and was doing all of this. And most of it ended up, just, he didn't actually have a moustache, but by the time he finished he had a moustache akin to Charles Chaplin and some other less uh, salubrious uh, character from history. Uh, yes. Anyway, a big thank you, Count and Junior. That is a very thoughtful, very kind thing for you to do. Um, I'm, and I will get, I will uh, enjoy using that uh, it, from here on inwards. Uh, thank you ever so much. So anyway, that was just my little thank you videos uh, to people. Uh, much appreciated, and I hope you're all well. And I hope where you are, the sun is shining, and you're able to get out of the house without having to put sweaters on and uh, you know all that sort of stuff. Anyway, cheers. Thank you.